playing Pokemon Sun. So in the last episode, I believe we evolved our tiny little Rockruff into our Lycanroc, and we're right outside, or just about to take, or actually no, we took the Express. There's a Pokemon Center up here. I'm gonna talk to this guy. Sorry, youngster, but I can't fight you. My Pokemon is like a brother to me, and he's not interested in battling weaklings. If you want him to ask to fight him against you, then beat all the trainers on Mount Holukani. So I've actually... I know for a fact that there are, you can find Ditto in this grass. Firo, no, I don't want you. But actually, I, I know that you can find Ditto in this grass. Um, yeah, you can. Couldn't get away. Yeah, but... Okay, I'll show you guys one more wild encounter. If it's not a ditto, I'll look for one and um, see. Oh, yeah, I'll see you guys if this one isn't a ditto when I find one. I think it's only 20% chance, but yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, guys, I am back. Um, I did not find a ditto, unfortunately. I've been searching for a long time. All I was able to find was Firos and Skarmories, which I didn't want. But I think I managed to defeat all the trainers on this route, so let's see. Are you the one who defeated all the trainers on Mount Ho Hokulani, then? Alright, then, fair enough. I like kids with a bit of pep. I'll be using my Z-Power against you. You ready for a scuffle? Let's go. I think I feel something coming over me. Sorry, kid, but my Pokemon don't know the meaning of the word moderation. Okay, landed a bit thick, but okay. Right. One Pokemon. Absol. That is a good Pokemon. I do want one of those. Go, Finneon. Crap. What type is it? Yep, I think I'm screwed. Finneon just doesn't have the defense for that. Ouch. Alright, so he's a dark type, huh? I'll try Lil Doggy. Lil Doggy's been successful in the past. And quickly, since this is a level 30 Pokemon, I want to revive Finneon. Just so that it'll get some HP. Night Slash. What the hell? Little Doggy just went down in one hit. We'll try, um, Hoof God then. Hoof God has some gnarly defense. Alright. Come on, Hoof God. Eat it up, Hoof God. Alright, come on, Hoof God. One hit. Come on. Let's just go high horsepower. No chill. Ow. If not for that stamina, Hoof God wouldn't be here. Twenty nine for Finion, that's good. Safeguard. I I've heard of that move before. I've never actually used it. What is it? Prevent status conditions. No, I don't want it. I don't really need it. 32 for Charger Bug. 31 for Big Bird. 33 for... Oh! Fury Swipes. No! Guys! Wait, 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 wait. 33. You've got some good Pokemon, kid. Thanks for showing my brother a good time. Here's your thanks. 
Snarl, huh? You know, Z-Power is more or less the power of the pledge you've made to your Pokemon. And my relationship with my Pokemon is closer than the parent of brother or brother or anything. Alright. What does this TM do? The user yells as if it's ranting about something which lowers the special attack. So it's an attack, but it lowers also lowers the special attack. Not bad, <laughs> actually. Um, but... If I'm correct, Pal evolves at level 34, so I did find a rare candy, so let's see if we can use that on Pal. You guys, it did work! It happening! Our little Toricat, it is evolving. Level 34, I knew it. Yeah. My, um, Dartrix evolved into Decidueye at level 34 in my last playthrough, so I, so I knew. But now our pal is a beastly Incineroar. Wow. <laughs> Number six. Completed a whole page in the Pokedex, too. Not bad. And of course, who wants to learn its signature move, Darkest Lariat? I guess we get rid of Ember. 85 power. And the target's stat changes don't affect the power of this move. That's insane, actually. That's a really good ability. Because that means, like, if they lower their, like, lower your special attack or, like, up their defense or something like that. It doesn't work, so this would be good against uh, Hoof God, because the stamina won't affect it. So, that's pretty cool. But now, I want to go into Pokemon Center and go talk to that guy over there at the lab. I will put Finneon not in front, I'll put Pow in front. But I do got, I want to show you what Dark's Lariat looks like, it looks really cool. Um, no, not this. This. Alright. No. Move. There. Easy. Okay. Let's get out of here. And go over to here. Hey there. You're still as fired up as ever, eh, Royal? Huh. Oh, and let me introduce you. This is Mullane. He runs the observatory here and also manages PC boxes, but he's not Hulikandi's captain. I was the captain once, my masked friend. Masked Royal. It's Owen, right? Thanks for coming all the way to, up to Hulikandi to visit us. But our captain, Sophocles, is a busy young man. Always calculating comets paths or working on that festival plaza thing of his. So I'll just determine whether you're qualified to take on the trial. I'll gladly show you the skills of a trainer who's toughened up while adventuring alongside Kukui back in the day. Oh, so we get to battle him. Nice. I had a feeling that we were going to come, some sort of important battle was going to be there. So, I healed up at the Pokemon Center. Skarmory. Interesting. Alright. Fire Fang is super effective. Avoided the attack. I see how it is, Skarmory. One more of those and we'll be all set. Air cutter, huh? That's not gonna do anything to Pal. Alright. A lot of XP for this too, that'll be good. 31 for Lil Doggy. Ground type. Oh, I forget what's good. I think water's good against ground. Well, I accidentally pressed B, so I guess that's not happening. I forgot how absolutely ridiculous the Alolan Dugtrio look. 
Look at this move. <laughs> that move is absolutely insane. Matang. I don't know if it's electric type, but I think ground is good against steel. I don't know. We'll just try Hoof God. It does have our most powerful move, I believe. Even though Darkest Lariat looks overpowered, only 85 to 95 for high horsepower. So, yeah. This, this just smacked you right in the face, Hoof God. Are you going to take that? You're not going to take that. To oh, come on. Just use a bulldoze to save power points. Are you freaking kidding me? It, it, its speed is going to fall. I think. I thought. Bullet punch. Get him, hoof gun. Nice. You're with Kukui. Looks like he brought along a good trainer. I have been training on my Pokemon on the side, if you guys haven't noticed. Their levels are a bit up from last episode. Well, well, you certainly seem qualified to take on the trial. Yeah, I think it's even stronger than we, than we were at this point in our island challenge. One more thing, cousin. The name's Kukui. Who's this masked royale you're talking about? Alright, cousin. I'm heading back to Melee Garden. I figure I should be done eating all solid by now, yeah? I'll make sure he makes it up here, too. You do that. That guy's as interesting as ever. My old buddy. Welcome to our observ observatory, Owen. Cool. Um, I think I'm gonna heal up, actually. We didn't, I mean... We didn't really lose that much health. But it's nothing a super potion can't fix. There we go. And fire is super effective against electric as well, so we should be fine. Um, I'm not sure where we're supposed to go, actually. Uh, in here, I guess? In here. That looks important. Yep. You're getting close to your goal. I imagine that you must have come here to do something to trial, huh? So, uh, do you, look, do you like Festival Plaza? I guess so. I don't even know what it is. Oh, if that's the case, then. Fine, whatever. Let's get started. Right now? Right now. Right here. <sighs> you summon the totem Pokemon and prove your strength to it. That's what every trial boils, boils down to, right? So I thought, why don't I just call the totem here from the start? So I tried a little bit of this and that, and I think I've whipped up a little device to call the totem Pokemon. Perhaps you're wondering why I built a machine. Here at the observatory, we also monitor sounds that we detect from outer space. These are some sounds that are inaudible to people, but Pokemon can hear just fine. We broadcast the sounds we have gathered ter terrestrially and monitor the reactions of Pokemon. The machine that summons the totem Pokemon makes use of this technology. Utilizing other sounds we have gathered, we also developed a security system here. But that was actually Big Mo, probably Mullane's invention. Just so you know, this will actually be my first time trying it out. So I'm glad you came. I needed a test subject. Ping Totem Pokemon 2.0 Engage! Now the totem should... Oh, no way, did I blow a fuge? A few fuge, fuse, fuse. Ah, the door closed? Let's see, we need to turn off the security system to get the door open. You'll have to pass an audio quiz. It, it's fine, I definitely feel a powerful presence. It's coming now. The Toady Pokemon is coming. So let's get this trial going, okay? My trial is about to begin. All right, trial start. In order to open the door, please respond to the following audio quiz. All right, what sound do you hear? That's easy. Pokemon Center. Correct. Opening door. Oh, as soon as the door opened, a Pokemon came through. I'm counting on you, Owen. I'm guessing it's a Grubbin. Yeah. We used to have a little Grubbin of our own. Alright, it's level 27. It is still an electric type. Oh, it's a bug type. That's why. So we're just going to absolutely annihilate it right there. <laughs> Nothing 
nothing to be said, really. I mean, I know you could do it, Owen. Oh, and just when I said it, the door closed again. It's going to be okay. The total Pokemon is on its way. Detecting presence of approaching totem Pokemon. Oh, there's a Zygarde cell right there. I missed that. In order to open the door, please respond to the following audio quiz. You hear the sound when you get what? Rotom Dex. Correct. Opening door. I, I remember that because like when, when um, Rotom was opening, I remember that. Well, as soon as the door opened, the Pokemon came through. This one's up to you. You too, Owen. Oh, of course it's up to me. It's a charge bug because it obviously said charge. So what do you think it's going to be? Pow should take, get rid of it pretty quickly. Fire fang it up, bruh. I think it's actually a bug and electric type, so maybe that'll make it a four times weakness to fire, because bug and electric are both weak to fire. So I think I've just found this trial's secret weakness. 32 for Hoof God. Well, everyone seems to be getting more levels than Finneon. Like, Finneon is like, it's behind a lot, and everyone else seems to be getting a lot more levels. I knew you could do it, Owen. Oh, and would you look at that? The door closed again while I was flapping my jaw. It's gonna be okay. The totem Pokemon is on its way. Totem Pokemon still approaching. Oh, that's on Mount Holokani. I was just there, actually. The security system system has been 50% shut down. In order to open the door, please respond to the following audio quiz. Which Pokemon's cry is this sound? Charge bug. It looks like the door's about to open. Another charge bug. I'm, I knew it. I'm counting on you again, Owen. Jeez, don't you have your own Pokemon? Like, actually. I mean, Electric is not very effective against Electric, but still. I have to fight all your battles for you. Ah. Uh, yeah, I mean, the thing is, I don't want to waste power points on Fire Fang. Yeah, I only have two more left before it becomes not very effective. Or, uh, uh, not as effective. Finally, Finny on to level 30. I've been waiting for that. <laughs> Trust me. I know you could do it, Owen. And then, of course, when the door goes and shuts again. Fool me once, shame on the door. Fool me twice, shame on the security system. Fool me thrice, shame on me, I guess. Here it comes, picking up traces of the totem Pokemon extremely close by. Is it that close? Oh. Totem Pokemon incoming. It's right there. This is the final security question. In order to open the door, please respond to the following audio quiz. What appears when you hear the following music? Totem Pokemon. <laughs> Correct. Opening door. I knew it. Hmm? This sound, this presence I sense. Here? Th there it is, the totem Pokemon. This is your time to shine, Owen. Vikavolt, the totem Pokemon of Holokani Observatory, has appeared. Hmm. Totem Vikavolt. Does all of its stats rise with its... All of its stats. All right. A couple of Darkest Lariats. I think should be okay. Or Fire Fangs, I guess. Oh, I should use my Z-move. Oh! Wait, maybe that... Oh, yeah. It was it was a damage-weakening berry. Special defense. Crap! I'm gonna use a Z-move. That's what I'm gonna do. We'll go... Z-power. Inferno Overdrive. Oh, no! I used it on Charger Bug. That was literally the biggest waste of a Z-move ever. That really, really, really sucks. Dang it. 
I was just pressing so fast I totally forgot that it automatically targets charge bug. That like if it would have been done if that actually hit. Dang it. At least Pal's getting some levels. Spark. Ouch! Go on, pal. Use an unlikable this time. One more of those and it's done. But one more of those, possibly. Uh, no, I'm not done. No. It's ally Pokemon. Come on, pal. Move first. Come on, pal. Move first. Come on. MVP! Totem Vikavolt is defeated. Thousand EXP points. 32 for Big Bird. T Way. Oh, come on, Charger Bug. Don't be like that. I was going to switch out anyways. I want someone else to get the biggest EXP. Alright. Alright, that's okay. Charger Bug is almost there. I'll go Lil Doggy for two reasons. One, because it's lower level than Charger Bug. And two, because all of its rock moves are super effective. Ouch. Rock Tomb it up. Come on, Lil Doggy. One hit KO. MVP number two, Lil Doggy, one hit KO. 700 XP points. That's not too bad, but that is enough to get it to level 32. 33 for Charge Bug. Got him, pal. Or not pal, Lil Doggy. Lil Doggy's the MVP of this one. There's Mudsdale. I know pal is MVP for one of them. Don't know what that is. Oh, lights came back on. Sophie, Big Mo, nice work, Captain. You helped Owen here through his trial, and your experiment was a success. It seems that your Ping Pokemon, no, Ping Totem Pokemon 2.0 uses too much electricity. If we can get a little assistance from Charger Bug, we should be able to make some improvements. Here, Owen. I'll give you this Electrium Z to reward you for beating the Totem Pokemon. Nice. Trial complete! That was pretty good. Do say so myself. You watching? It was fine when the power was off. Jeez, now that you can see me, I feel all nervous. Uh, I'm not sure what to say. Thanks, or uh, congratulations. You passed my trial. Congratulations on clearing your trial. And you, Sophocles, you did well as captain. I was really nervous. Don't you worry. I'm sure that I made the right choice in naming you captain, even if you are my cousin. Usually it's the island of Kahuna who appoints the captains, but there are some uh, unusual circumstances here on Ula Ula. So somehow I ended up captain. But you were really great, Owen. I see. Then let me reward you. Oh, a Steelium Z. This is one of the Z quests that I collected long ago during my own island challenge to prove my strength and that of my Pokemon. So it seems fitting that it goes from me to you. Take it and use it well. And if we were done here, Owen, could I ask you a favor for me? Professor Kook, we forgot this. Battle Royale or what? Like, actually. How can you guys not see that? Key items. He said I wasn't. He would be going back to Melee Garden. Can you take it to him? Maybe next time we can battle. And that is going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, make sure to smash that like button in the face and subscribe for more daily great content from yours truly. I will see all you guys in the next video. Peace out.